And Tennessee Democratic State Representative Bo Mitchell joins me now with more on this. Representative Mitchell, thank you for being on. Uh, one of your Good assistant's morning. daughters was actually in the school when this happened. They have since reunited. Uh, what are you hearing from them? It, you know, unfortunately, you know, she's having to tell her daughter that through her classmates, she's never going to see again. Uh, that's that's tragic that you have to have those types of conversations with your children in our country. Now, you've said that we need courage to address gun violence in the United States. What do you mean by that? I, I, I'm tired of my colleagues being scared of the NRA, scared, you know, you know, they they think they could lose a primary or something. You know, it it's time, as I said on the House floor last night, my children are worth more than every assault rifle in this country. What do you say to politicians who are arguing that this shows that we need more guns, that teachers need to be armed? Uh, you know, a Wild West gunfight in the halls of a of a school is, is not the answer. Uh, you know, I think Connecticut after Newtown, they had an assault weapons ban, a uh, high capacity magazine ban and enhanced background checks. And I think their murder rate since then has went down 41% in the state of Connecticut. So I think it works. A representative, police found three weapons at the scene. There is legislation before the Tennessee legislature that could make open carrying of long guns like AR-15s legal to anyone 18 or older. Uh, do you think this shooting will make lawmakers reconsider that position? Probably not. Uh, you know, it's insanity. Uh, you know, it, it's almost embarrassing. You know, you'll go, you'll go to a restaurant and you'll see someone sitting beside you just with a weapon. I mean, if they're that scared, you know, they just need to stay at home if they, you know, can't go out in public without, without their gun. So, Representative, what more do you think can be done to prevent these kinds of shootings from happening? The bottom line is the pro proliferation of, of uh, assault rifles. You know, most of these mass shootings are done with assault rifles. You know, if, if this lady did not have two assault rifles, she probably couldn't have shot her way into that school, or if she was able to shoot her way into that school, it would have taken a lot more time for her to get in. And the reaction of the police, as you saw, they reacted and took down the threat within 14 minutes. But when someone has an assault rifle, you can do a lot of damage in 14 minutes. All right, Democratic Tennessee State Representative Bo Mitchell, we appreciate your time today. Thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.